throwing this short video together very quickly because of the sudden and urgent concerns over the coronavirus. While the obvious priority has to be the medical one, I'm focusing here only on the economic aspects. Hopefully, though, experts will ultimately hear about this and then they can argue about it. The premise of it is very simple, although there would be a lot of details to manage. But it will only take me a couple of minutes to explain to you. So, here goes. Could we temporarily shut down all trading in the markets just for the time being until we have gotten this situation under control? This panic in the stock market has absolutely nothing to do with actual underlying economic fundamentals. Companies were doing pretty well until all of a sudden they weren't. Yes, there will be a severe economic downsizing, but it's all being triggered by this specific external thing, and it will all be over once we get it under control. But until then, the markets will overreact, which does nothing helpful and actually makes things much worse than they need to be. The plummeting stock market reduces the value of assets, which then forces people to sell and downsize, creating a kind of ripple effect. It's like pouring gasoline on a fire. This is completely different than the situation we had during the 2008 crisis, when there was a genuine economic need for this severe correction. We are only having this problem now because of the fears of the pandemic. Until this health crisis settles down, the market will be in this extreme state of manic depression. So, could we just sit it out, put it in a kind of coma, and wait until it all subsides? The period afterward would be a delicate one to manage, but I think it could be done. So, here's the question. Is this idea completely impractical or crazy? Well, here's something to think about. We shut the market down every weekend. So, at least that part isn't impossible. Compare all the costs and problems of doing it this other way versus the over $11 trillion of value that the American markets alone have lost since its peak a month ago. And the collateral damages from this will cost many trillions of dollars more in the end. So, maybe it'd just be better to put the markets to sleep for now. Okay, that's all I had to say. Now, I'm going to binge watch this season of Homeland.